Certain QSYS appliances, like the Core 110F, have a unique best-in-class analog audio connection technology called flex channels that let the integrator designate a connection as an input or as an output. Core 110F, for instance, has eight of these flex channels, in addition to the eight fixed analog inputs and the eight fixed analog outputs. Let's take a look at how the directionality of these flex channels are managed in the QSYS Designer software. Start off by dragging your flex in and flex out components from the inventory panel into the schematic. Now, at first glance, this block looks like it's got eight input channels and eight output channels, but each of these pins is individually selectable to be active as either a flex in or a flex out channel, making it only active on one of these components at a time. You make the selection in their respective control panels. So let's double click the components and I'll enter emulation mode so that we can make these adjustments. The very first row indicates the directionality of each channel. If the blue light is active here in the flex in control panel, then the channel is being used as an input. Now, if you go to flex out, flex out. nobody wants that. If I go to the flex out control panel, uh, you'll notice that all of the lights are off. If I activate channel one as an output, you'll notice that the light turns off in the flex in control panel. Obviously, each channel can only be active in one control panel at a time. You'll also notice that these buttons can only be activated. You can't deactivate it by clicking on it again. To deactivate channel two as an input, for instance, you need to enable it as an output. Just be aware that changing these settings does not alter the number of pins on the component. If you're not careful, you might accidentally wire audio to a flex out channel, for instance, that's actually configured as an input. And that's it. Once you decide if each channel is an input or an output, QSYS handles the configuration of that connection. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.